Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Webdev. In this video, we will see how we can retrieve the data in a documents only that limited fields. How we can do it? Let's try to see that one in this video. Normally, we call this concept as a projection. So that means how we can get the specified values only, specified field values only. So that let's say that we are having a categories collection. In that categories collection, we'll be having a document which contains the fields of title, status, description, category ID. So like this, we'll be having so many data. But I want only the single value. There is nothing but the category name only. So there is specified fields only. If I want to extract the specified fields only from the document or from the categories collection means how we can do it let's try to see in this video so for example let's say that i am having a db dot categories dot find so we have already seen about this one so right now we are having only id and the title let's try to update here so db dot categories dot update many i can use this one and here i can use like this and here i can use something like so we can use dollar set property in such a way that so in order to update the existing record what i can use here so i can use the dollar set okay so i can use dollar set and i can pass let's say the description so something and also what i can say um, status or otherwise title is there description is there uh, slug okay i can use some slug so let's say that we are having these many details or otherwise i can use category id anything whatever the thing i want to explain now here let's try to add it now here 24 modifications has been done so if i want to check db dot categories dot categories dot find dot pretty okay so now if i try to see here we are able to see almost all the data now each document is having all the details showing all the details something like id title category id description slug so these are all the details are available for each document so that means when we want to now when we are trying to access from the network so this much of data from the document so through the wire it, it causes the performance issue right so now if you uh, now here if you you may use only the title thing okay you may require only the title thing from the database but this mongodb what it is trying to send you your it is trying to send all the details that are available in the object so this could be an issue so uh, this could be a performance issue so in mongodb what i can do is in the find method i can get the projected details so i can get the projected fields only fields value only how can i get that one is let's try to show you db dot categories dot find okay find of so like first one is first first parameter is the condition filter so that i am giving it as empty object and the second one is the thing which what are the fields you want so i want only the title so title column one one means true so i want only the title so if you don't want anything means you can you can keep something like description as zero so by default everything uh, if you provide a pro if you provide this project configuration so this one projection configuration if you try to provide everything will be zero so whatever the fields you try to keep it as one so those fields only will be displayed if i try to cl click on this one title of one dot pretty i will try to do this one so now if i try to see we are able to see id and also a title but we haven't but we haven't selected this id we have selected only the title title field only but here it is we, we are getting the also the id field also if you don't want this id by default what you can see think is the id property so this id field is by default it will be true so that means it will by default it will be one only if you don't mention or if you mention also by default mongodb will try to send this unique id primary key id something like that so what are the fields you want you want it will be explicitly it will be displayed so now if you don't want means so if you don't want this id also to be displayed means what i can do is so you need to mention the id here so that means underscore id should be zero so i don't want so you are must and should mention that i don't want the id now if you try to display so here you are able to get the titles and all those things now you need to understand that 
the documents are not deleted the fields whatever the fields are present in the document are not deleted so just it is getting you extracting you the just content that is only title field only from the documents so this is how we can extract the data whatever the fields data we want in a document we can do it using this find method second parameter so whatever the fields you want you can use it as one so that you can get the data so this is one thing so now you need to understand that we can also have the embedded documents so document inside a document document inside a document like this embedded documents you can also have it so it is also allowed so now the maximum level of documentation depth it will be around 100 so you can have more than not one also but we will rarely use three to four depth only three to four levels only you use this json depth but normally it will support 100 and also what i can say is so the maximum document size so each document size is around 16 mb so this is also one of the important thing you need to understand the maximum each document size in the collection is around 16 mb now if, now see i will try to show you how we can have this embedded document so for example if i try to show you let's try to remove this one all okay so here you are having so this one right so this is these are our one level only so now i will have a details field inside that one it will take an object something like name description last updated these are all the details it will try to take it so let's try to add that one so how we can add is so db dot categories dot update mini okay you can use this update mini and i want to update to all the fields and i can use dollar set so i want to up update a new one details okay so details will again take an object and here i can use last updated something like um, two days ago something like this i can use and another one is status so it should be of type uh, status or uh, what i can say name so leela and the channel name so we can use whatever the names you want you can use it so here i am writing so now if i try to update so all the 24 documents got updated if you try to see here so now here this is this one is our one level and details it again went into another level so this is second level and in this detail is again an embedded document so this is an embedded document inside the document we are having again a document so which is having a key value pair so last updated name channel name like this you'll be having so if you want you can also the document also accepts the arrays also so for example if i want to add an array so for example let's say that we'll try to use the same thing so update many i'm trying to remove these all the things so let's try to or otherwise let's try to add it by by our own we'll add it db dot categories dot update many and i can use something like again dollar set colon so here i can use the hobbies and it can take an array sports comma cooking so like this it can take anything this one yeah sports comma cooking so like this i can add so now a 24 documents has been updated if you try to see here so we are having a details and we are having a hobbies the details is taking an object okay and the hobbies is taking an array so everything is so everything is supported so here you can have an area area of data or otherwise area of object also you can have it not a problem and here you can have the details which is an embed document so like this everything is included so now the total document size this total document size should be around 16 mb so it should not be over than 16 mb and like this details inside another object like this inside another object like this you can have around 100 uh, next level 100 levels you can have it but rarely we will be using two to three levels only so more than that two to three levels we can we will rarely use more than that so this is all about this document uh, embedded documents and also the document projection so how we can get the projected fields only so the if the mention name fields only if you want to get means how we can use it so this is the how we can get it hope you understood about this one if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you